Hey tribe, so I'm going to show you how I use the magic knot to turn scraps of yarn into a ball of yarn that will then work up like this. I've used this effect in my pattern called example. It's really simple to do, all you need is some scraps of yarn. So here I've got two colours that I want to put together. You then lay out a length like so and another length like this and you tie a knot around one like this I'm just gonna say if you can see black on my hands it's because I'm painting my fence so please excuse any stains so we have tied a knot a few inches in at least and then you want to tie a knot around this end of the dark pink your second color like so and then once you've got the two knots, you pull these tight together and that then knots the two yarns together like so. Then you just need to get your scissors, get some scissors, snip it off as close as you can. And there you have it. You've got a magic knot and no matter how much you pull on that, it won't come undone. And when you do a stitch such as this one, which is the half treble crochet or the double crochet, you can barely see where the knots are unless you get very close. And that way, usually you can hide it within a stitch. That one just so happens to poke out, but it's no problem. But considering how many colour changes there are in here and how many of the knots you can't see, I am pretty impressed with that. So you, you will then just continue to wind these colours into a ball and then once you've got a ball large enough made from scraps you can then start on your pattern. It saves you having to weave in so many ends. So that's how you do the magic knot. Happy making!